is a part of realization, realizing or recognizing that everything is self-created? What do you mean by self-created? That each, each experience that one has is a, a doing of their own, that they're of their own makeup, of their own blood, of their own Well, it's, happen it's happening to you, but who knows if you, you know you created it, see? There may be two distinctly different functions of awareness. Uh, assuming responsibility for creating it, or less, and, and thus being, let's say, um, on the receiving end of it. Mm -hmm. So in, in the case of the receiving, and in the case of the transmitting, yes, you're doing all of it. Not, maybe not consciously. Mm -hmm. You set it up, you were born, you set it up, and you're experiencing it for all it's worth in the moment. All of this is an agreement. How could you be here if you didn't agree to it? You know, by force? <laughs> well, you agree to it. We, we agree to, to this. So. And that's also the truth in, in the worst situation. This is a great situation here. Perfect. Right. But under the worst situations, you agree to be there. Otherwise, you would be there. So you have to think, and you hear some people say, what the heck was I thinking when, when, I, when I agreed to this, whatever it was. I knew I shouldn't have gone, gone out with those guys. They drink too much. <laughs> I knew this could have happened. Right? We have those moments. So then you back up and you, you consider what you need to create for yourself and how to best do it so that you're on the, the, the best end of it and feeling good about it instead of questioning. You know, how did you get into that situation since, you know, you put yourself there? Unless it was by abduction. <laughs> and you put yourself there too. 